If you've ever heard of the importance of calcium in your body, then you probably know that it's essential for maintaining strong bones and teeth. But did you know that there's a hormone that plays a crucial role in regulating calcium absorption? That hormone is calcitriol, also known as vitamin D hormone. Understanding calcitriol is vital in ensuring optimal calcium levels in your body. In this ultimate guide, we'll take a deep dive into the science behind calcitriol, its functions in the body, and how it affects your overall health. We'll explore its sources, how it's synthesized, and the conditions that affect its production. Whether you're a health enthusiast or just curious about the human body, this guide will provide you with a comprehensive understanding of calcitriol and its role in maintaining healthy calcium levels. So sit back, relax, and get ready to learn everything you need to know about this incredible hormone. What is calcitriol and how does it work? Calcitriol is a hormone that is produced in the kidneys from vitamin D. It is the active form of vitamin D and is responsible for regulating calcium absorption in the body. The process begins when the skin is exposed to sunlight, which triggers the production of vitamin D in the body. Vitamin D is then transported to the liver, where it is converted into an inactive form called calcidiol. Calcidiol is then transported to the kidneys, where it is converted into calcitriol, the active form of vitamin D. Calcitriol works by increasing the absorption of calcium from the intestines into the bloodstream, which is essential for maintaining healthy bones and teeth. It also helps to maintain normal levels of calcium and phosphate in the blood and promotes the formation of bone tissue. Calcitriol is a vital hormone that plays a significant role in maintaining optimal calcium levels in the body. Without calcitriol, the body would not be able to absorb enough calcium, which could lead to weakened bones and teeth. The Role of Calcitriol in Calcium Absorption Calcium is an essential mineral that is required for many bodily functions, including muscle contractions, nerve function, and blood clotting. The body needs a constant supply of calcium to maintain these functions, and calcitriol plays a crucial role in ensuring that the body has enough calcium. Calcitriol increases the absorption of calcium from the intestines into the bloodstream by stimulating the production of calcium-binding proteins. These proteins bind to calcium and transport it across the intestinal wall and into the bloodstream, where it can be used by the body. Calcitriol also promotes the reabsorption of calcium from the kidneys back into the bloodstream, which helps to maintain normal levels of calcium in the blood. This process is essential because the body cannot produce calcium on its own and must rely on external sources to maintain healthy levels. Calcitriol deficiency and its effects on the body. Calcitriol deficiency can lead to a condition called rickets in children and osteomalacia in adults. Rickets is a condition that results in weak, soft bones, while osteomalacia is a condition that causes bone pain and muscle weakness. Calcitriol deficiency can also lead to osteoporosis, a condition that causes bones to become weak and brittle. Osteoporosis increases the risk of fractures, especially in the hips, spine, and wrists. Calcitriol deficiency can be caused by a lack of vitamin D in the diet or insufficient exposure to sunlight. Other factors that can affect calcitriol production include kidney disease, liver disease, and certain medications. What is calcitriol deficiency? Calcitriol, also known as vitamin D3, is a hormone synthesized in the body when the skin is exposed to sunlight. It plays a vital role in maintaining healthy bones, regulating calcium and phosphorus levels, supporting immune function, and promoting overall well-being. Calcitriol deficiency occurs when there is an insufficient amount of vitamin D in the body. Causes of Calcitriol Deficiency Several factors contribute to the development of calcitriol deficiency, including Limited sun exposure Inadequate exposure to sunlight, particularly in regions with limited sunlight or during winter months, can lead to a deficiency in calcitriol production. Dietary insufficiency Consuming a diet low in vitamin D-rich foods, such as fatty fish, fortified dairy products, and egg yolks, can contribute to calcitriol deficiency. Malabsorption disorders Certain medical conditions that affect the absorption of fat-soluble vitamins, such as Crohn's disease, celiac disease, and cystic fibrosis, can lead to calcitriol deficiency. Kidney and liver disorders Impaired kidney or liver function can affect the conversion of inactive vitamin D to its active form, leading to calcitriol deficiency. Age and skin pigmentation Older adults and individuals with darker skin pigmentation have a higher risk of calcitriol deficiency due to decreased vitamin D synthesis in the skin. Symptoms of calcitriol deficiency Calcitriol deficiency may manifest through various symptoms, including Bone weakness Insufficient vitamin D levels can result in weakened bones, increasing the risk of fractures and osteoporosis. Muscle weakness 
Vitamin D plays a crucial role in maintaining muscle strength, and a deficiency can lead to muscle weakness and increased risk of falls. Fatigue and weakness. Low calcitriol levels can contribute to fatigue, lethargy, and a general feeling of weakness. Mood changes. Some studies have suggested a link between vitamin D deficiency and mood disorders such as depression and anxiety. Impaired immune function. Vitamin D plays a vital role in supporting a healthy immune system, and deficiency may lead to increased susceptibility to infections. Cognitive impairment. Emerging research suggests that low vitamin D levels may be associated with cognitive decline and an increased risk of conditions like Alzheimer's disease. It is important to note that these symptoms may vary in severity, and some individuals may experience no symptoms at all. Regular screenings and blood tests can help detect calcitriol deficiency and guide appropriate treatment. Impacts of calcitriol deficiency on the body. Calcitriol deficiency can have wide-ranging impacts on the body. Some of the potential consequences include bone health. Vitamin D is essential for calcium absorption and maintaining proper bone health. A deficiency can lead to conditions like osteoporosis, rickets in children, and an increased risk of fractures in adults. Muscle function. Vitamin D plays a role in muscle strength and function. Insufficient levels may contribute to muscle weakness, impaired balance, and an increased risk of falls. Immune system. Vitamin D is involved in modulating immune responses, and its deficiency may compromise immune function, increasing the susceptibility to infections and autoimmune diseases. Cardiovascular health. Some studies have suggested a link between calcitriol deficiency and an increased risk of cardiovascular diseases, including hypertension, heart disease, and stroke. However, further research is needed to establish a definitive connection. Mental health. Emerging evidence suggests a potential association between low vitamin D levels and mental health disorders, such as depression and seasonal affective disorder, SAD. Metabolic health. Vitamin D is believed to play a role in maintaining healthy glucose metabolism and insulin sensitivity. Deficiency may contribute to an increased risk of type 2 diabetes and metabolic syndrome. Managing calcitriol deficiency. If you suspect or have been diagnosed with calcitriol deficiency, several strategies can help manage and improve your vitamin D levels. Sunlight exposure. Spending time outdoors and exposing your skin to sunlight can stimulate the production of vitamin D in your body. However, it is important to balance sun exposure to avoid the harmful effects of excessive UV radiation. Dietary Changes Incorporating vitamin D-rich foods into your diet, such as fatty fish, salmon, mackerel, fortified dairy products, egg yolks, and mushrooms, can help increase your vitamin D intake. Supplementation In cases where natural sunlight and dietary sources are insufficient, vitamin D supplements may be recommended by healthcare professionals. It is important to consult with a healthcare provider to determine the appropriate dosage and duration. Regular monitoring. Periodic blood tests can help assess vitamin D levels and guide the effectiveness of the chosen management strategies. Lifestyle modifications. Leading a healthy lifestyle that includes regular exercise, a balanced diet, and adequate sleep can contribute to overall well-being and support optimal vitamin D levels. Remember, it is essential to consult with a healthcare professional for proper diagnosis, personalized advice, and guidance on managing calcitriol deficiency. They can provide recommendations based on your specific circumstances and medical history. How to test for calcitriol levels. Calcitriol levels can be measured with a blood test. The test is usually performed as part of a routine blood test and measures the amount of calcitriol in the blood. Calcitriol levels can also be measured with a urine test. The test measures the amount of calcium in the urine and can be used to determine if the body is absorbing enough calcium. Natural Ways to Increase Calcitriol Levels The best way to increase calcitriol levels is to get enough vitamin D from sunlight or food. The body can produce vitamin D when the skin is exposed to sunlight, so spending time outdoors is essential. Foods that are high in vitamin D include fatty fish, egg yolks, and fortified foods like milk and cereal. Supplements are also available for those who have difficulty getting enough vitamin D from sunlight or food. Regular exercise and weight-bearing activities can also help to increase calcitriol levels. These activities stimulate the production of vitamin D in the body and promote healthy bone growth. Calcitriol Supplements and Medication Calcitriol supplements are available for those who have a deficiency in the hormone. The supplements are usually taken orally and can help to increase calcium absorption in the body. Calcitriol is also available as a medication for the treatment of conditions like osteoporosis and kidney disease.
The medication is usually taken orally or injected and works by increasing calcium absorption in the body. Side effects and risks of excessive calcitriol levels. Excessive calcitriol levels can lead to a condition called hypercalcemia, which is characterized by high levels of calcium in the blood. Symptoms of hypercalcemia include nausea, vomiting, constipation, and confusion. Long-term use of calcitriol supplements or medication can also increase the risk of kidney stones and calcium deposits in the soft tissues of the body. It is essential to consult a healthcare professional before taking any supplements or medication to ensure that they are safe and effective. Calcitriol and Bone Health Calcitriol plays a vital role in maintaining healthy bones and teeth. Without adequate levels of calcitriol, the body would not be able to absorb enough calcium, which could lead to weakened bones and teeth. Calcitriol deficiency can lead to conditions like rickets, osteomalacia, and osteoporosis, which can result in weak, brittle bones and an increased risk of fractures. Calcitriol supplements and medication can help to increase calcium absorption in the body and improve bone health. Regular exercise and weight-bearing activities can also help to stimulate the production of vitamin D in the body and promote healthy bone growth. Conclusion The Importance of Understanding Calcitriol Calcitriol is a crucial hormone that plays a significant role in maintaining healthy calcium levels in the body. Without adequate levels of calcitriol, the body would not be able to absorb enough calcium, which could lead to weakened bones and teeth. Understanding calcitriol is essential for maintaining optimal bone health and preventing conditions like rickets, osteomalacia, and osteoporosis. By getting enough vitamin D from sunlight or food and engaging in regular exercise and weight-bearing activities, you can help to stimulate the production of calcitriol and maintain healthy calcium levels in your body. If you suspect that you have a calcitriol deficiency, it is essential to consult a healthcare professional to determine the best course of treatment. With the right treatment and lifestyle choices, you can maintain healthy bones and teeth and prevent the negative effects of calcitriol deficiency. Thanks for watching.